Cats are being mad annoying right now. It's literally five in the morning and he hasn't stopped barking. What? Why are you barking? It's five o'clock in the morning. Danny just got to my house and I'm gonna answer the door naked. <laughs> just to show you, I'm not joking. <laughs> hey man. What's up? Put your freaking clothes on. <laughs> What's going on guys? Hope you guys are having the most blessed day of your entire lives. We're back with another video. Guys, look how great Emma is. She's out here cleaning the whole washroom for me before she heads out. Because she's staying at my mom's house because she doesn't stay here right now because of what's been going on. Who's so, fault is it the stuff that's been going on? Uh, I mean, uh, it's probably like a 50 50. Like, it could be anybody's fault. I mean, I, I don't want to point fingers here. Nobody really wants to point fingers. Like, we're not like that. We both take accountability. So, Emma takes the blame for all this weird shit happening in the house, and I just kind of deal with the stupid shit that she does. Uh, which in turn causes me pain and agony and suffering. Actually, my father-in-law is a lawyer, so you'll probably be hearing from him. I'm gonna sue her ass. Uh, Emma's great. I love her. She's cleaning up uh, the house with me right now. Well, I say with me, but I'm vlogging while she cleans. Can you throw these in the bag? Yes. Heads up. She's staying at my mom's house right now. She's been staying there for about a week now because she hasn't been staying um, here because of what's been going on. First of all, let me show you. Emma cleans the washroom really, really well. And then this is my attempt at cleaning the washroom. I bought this llama hamper. It's great. Um, I'm, I'm adulting. See, look at this. I'm a great adult. Uh, anyways, so back, back to what I was saying. So Emma's not staying here right now. She's staying at my mom's house with Max and my brother and my sister-in-law and my uh, nephew. So she's staying there because of all the creepy shit that's been happening here. Um, last time, something pulled her hair. We're not sure if it's a ghost, a demon, whatever the hell it is. But whatever it is, it pulled her hair. And honestly, it freaked us both out. I haven't slept in the bedroom since. She hasn't slept here since. I've been sleeping on the couch uh, with all the animals that we have here. Unfortunately, one of us has to stay here with the animals. We have five animals in this house. And we have a guinea, uh, two guinea pigs and two dogs at my mom's house. So it would literally be a zoo if we lived there. So Emma's staying there at night and she stays here during the day. While I stay here full time with all the pets, I have to feed them, take care of them and stuff like that and deal with whatever's here. So back to what I'm initially trying to say is we're gonna try some stuff tonight, okay? I wanna get to the bottom of this. I know you guys wanna get to the bottom of this and I'm confused because, Luna, get out of there. The other night, I gotta go turn off the fan. I always do this. I always start vlogging without turning off the fans. Okay, so here's the scoop. Today is Monday, August 19th. Yesterday morning, I woke up and I had this. This is kind of what prompted this video. I woke up and this was on my, on my hand. So that happened on, I don't know. I think it happened Saturday night, Sunday morning. Like I just kind of woke up with my hand. It felt like it was on fire. And I looked and there was this. It's blistered over now, but it was a lot worse when it had happened. This is not from an oven. It's not from the barbecue. It's not from a, a smoldering piece of metal, scorching piece of metal. I don't know. I don't cook. Like I literally only barbecue and I use the tongs when I barbecue. I never, ever touch the oven. Emma? Yeah. 
Do I touch the oven? No. Oh my god. No. You do not touch the oven because every time you touch the oven it was to cook a frozen pizza. And you always put the pizza in before the oven is preheated. So we never know how long to leave the pizza in for because it's not at the proper temperature to cook it. Yeah. So, so I'm, it always gets ruined. Exactly. So I'm not allowed to use the oven. I haven't used the oven since we moved in. And we've been here for about two months now. It's unknown where I got this. I honestly legitimately don't know. I think the only thing that pops in my head is whatever is here has marked me. I right away, the first thing that jumped to my head is that this is from whatever's living here. And so I Googled, which is what any researcher would do, because I'm a researcher. I'm not a researcher. I'm just an idiot with a camera. On the forums I read said that you could get marked by these, by demons. So I've been marked and I'm not entirely sure what that means. I want to find out what that means because it was kind of, you know, up in the air. I'm very confused. Very, very, very confused and I would like to know what is going down here. So we're going to do that. We're going to try to figure out a way to contact this thing. Maybe we'll use the Ouija board again. Maybe we will not do another seance. Seance was a bad idea. <laughs> uh, okay, so I'm going to figure out how to contact this thing and we're going to just figure out what to do tonight. So anyways, before we get started with that, you guys do me a massive favor. I need you guys to smash the like button, comment down below, and turn on post notifications. Follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok, and let's get on with the video. Oh my god. Okay, so I moved the litter box into my office, and let's just say the cats have... Uh, I never realized how stinky cats were until I had their litter box in my office. Not fun. What we're going to be doing today is we're going to be using an EVP, an electronic voice Pokemon. Okay, let me look at what an EVP actually is. Oh my god, it actually smells horrible in here. Okay, record ghost voices with EVP in 15 steps. So I figured the easiest way to communicate with this thing without using the Ouija board would be with an EVP. I've never done one of these by myself. I did one with Mo once and I'm not entirely sure how it works because he took control, he did everything. So I'm gonna try to do it with myself. So we're gonna be using my iPhone for the EVP. I'm gonna keep it quiet, so I've turned off all the fans. I'm gonna put the dogs away, and I'll put the cats away, so they're not gonna be running around making noise, so we can get as quiet as possible. Begin by stating out loud who you are, where you are, and what time it is. Do not whisper, talk in a normal tone of voice. Again, in a normal tone of voice, ask questions. Leave adequate space between your questions to allow the recorder to pick up any possible responses. Researchers often ask such uh, questions as, are there any spirits in here? Can you tell me your name? Can you tell me something about yourself? Why are you here? Surprisingly, EVP voices sometimes respond to direct questions. You don't need to spend hours recording, but give your session a good 10 to 20 minutes. Okay, cool. We'll probably do this for like five to 10 minutes. Listen to the recording. Now you can play the recording back to hear what you got. If anything, listen to the recording on the recorder's little speaker is usually inadequate. We might have to put this onto the computer and then listen it through there so we can get the better speakers. Actually, it says right here, download the recording. A better method of listening to, to and analyzing your recording is to download it to the computer. All right. Let's get started. Okay, new recording. Um, standing out loud who you are, where you are, and what time it is. My name is Ali. I am in my house, and it is currently 11.35 p.m. So I just told it that who I am, so let's ask it uh, some stuff. Are there any spirits in here? Can you tell me your name? Can you tell me about yourself? Why are you here? Are you disturbed? Did you die here?
Can you give me a sign that you are here right now with me? What is your name? Cats are being mad annoying right now. Are you, is there only one spirit here? Are you a spirit? What are you? Are you mad at me? Did I do something to upset you? What the f Okay, yo, I'm not doing the ZVP sh Nope. I'll, I'm gonna bang that up. Let's go. We're gonna go see what the hell is going on here. Hello? Cat, what do you see? What the f was that? Is that thunder? Okay, so I'm in my kitchen now. I think I'm gonna stay in this general area because at least here I can see everything that's happening so like I have a view of the living room and the dining area and the balcony and I'll be honest I'm scared as hell right now um, Milo is sneezing for some reason and he like his tails like going wild right now he's, he's wagging his tail he's jumping up he's very excited about something and I don't know what um, there was like a, a, a bang. I came outside to check it out. There was nothing here. Okay, I'm, I'm scared and I want to go over the EVP stuff since we're still here. So, um, here we go. Uh, I would turn it around and show you guys, but because I turned on the location thing, it literally it shows my address. So, I'm not going to do that. And now the camera's being blurry. Great. Okay, dogs, I need you to shut up for a sec. I love you, but you guys gotta be really quiet. Um, so we actually only got two minutes and 42 seconds of EVP. So. The recording, um, stating out loud who you are, where you are, and what time it is. My name is Ali. Do I sound like I'm right? in my house, and it is currently 11.35 p.m. who I am, so let's ask it uh, some stuff. Are there any spirits in here? Also, oh, this is coming right off my phone, by the way. Can you tell me your name? Can you tell me about yourself? Why are you here? I'm not hearing anything. Are you disturbed? Did you die here? Can you give me a sign that you are here right now with me? What is your name? Cats are being mad annoying right now. Are you, is there only one spirit here? Are you a spirit? What are you? Are 
are you mad at me? Did I do something to upset you? What the f***? Okay, yo, I'm not doing the ZVP shit. Nope. Okay, so definitely heard some stuff on there. Um, but I don't exactly know what it was. Like I heard, like some of the stuff I think was the cats, but some of it definitely wasn't. Like I could hear one of the cats in the litter box, but then I heard other stuff that definitely wasn't the cats. And the dogs I had put away in the washroom. So there's no way the dogs were out and making noise. If you guys heard anything, in particular, or if something jumps out to you guys and you guys hear something, because you guys are really good at this stuff, I'm honestly just an idiot with a camera, so I'm just trying my best here, but I think you guys are a lot better than this than I am, so please, please let me know in the comment section what you hear and um, what I should do next, because a lot of you guys are saying Sage, and I'll be honest, I don't know what Sage is, so I gotta figure that shit out, but you guys are saying get Sage, get a Priest, um, Man, I'm about to get like a priest, a, a sheikh, a friggin' a rabbi, like Batman. I'm gonna get everybody up in here and do whatever they can do because this is this stuff's getting out of hand, especially since I got this, and this is really frightening me to be honest because I don't know. Like online, it said I was marked, and I, I don't know what is it. What does marked mean? It, am I? What if I'm not? What if the, the, whatever this is was just being a dick and decided to burn me? So. I'm afraid Emma's hair got pulled too, right? So that's that's another thing that scares me. Like this thing's obviously not in a good place, and it doesn't like that we're here. But your boy bought the place, so we ain't going nowhere. So it's man versus ghost, ghost versus man, and dog and cats. So I'm not sure. But anyways, let me know what you guys think. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. Follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. Let me know if I should do another EVP session with an actual recorder or with an app that might be better suited for this kind of stuff. Um, let me know what you guys recommend because I'm, I wanna find out this stuff and you guys are literally my, the best way I can do this. So let me know what you guys think. Um, a lot of you guys are saying I have to move out. That's not gonna happen. I'm not leaving this place, I'm not moving out. I'm not gonna let some entity, some spirit, some vengeful kick me out of my place. That's not gonna happen. So let me know what you guys think because I need your help. And I just realized this is flashing in the background. I thought I had set it to a solid color, but apparently not. So I'm sorry. But yeah, okay, bye.